Love is a temporary madness. It erupts like volcanoes and then subsides. And when it subsides, you have to make a decision. You have to work out whether your roots have so entwined together that it is inconceivable that you should ever part. Connor Quinn Pariseau, there was no particular moment when I knew I was going to marry you. Instead, I feel like I knew it all along from the moment that I met you all those years ago. That feeling was there, that this was it, you were my forever. On September 6, 2015, Caitlin sent me this text message. Quote, I matched on Tinder with this guy that I find to be absolutely gorgeous. And he is just so respectful and so honest and he's so different. And I just appreciate who he is and we just click. And I just remember this feeling, this feeling in my heart. It unlocked a door. And it unlocked a door into a whole new expanse, a level of love that was limitless, that I never knew existed. And my love began pouring into it, just going into it, rushing into it. And it had grown into this limitless space and continues to grow, and right now it is growing. I love you with more depth and substance than I ever thought possible. One of the most satisfying rewards is seeing your child experience you. true love and happiness, which Caitlin absolutely has found with Connor. Thank you, Connor, for loving my girl. We are thrilled that you are now a permanent part of our family. No words, Boo, can express how much love and joy you have brought and continue to bring to my life. I love you forever. We fell in love up here on the North Shore, and I'm so happy to be able to make these promises to you in front of our family and friends in our favorite place. Today we make the most sincere promise a heart can make, and it is because of who you are and what we have built together that has brought us to today. Marriage is a gift of God. It's given to us for the joy and mutual strength we give to, to those who enter it. Jesus is with us, blessing your wedding. Connor and Caitlin, by their promises before God and in the presence of this assembly, have joined themselves to one another as husband and wife. Those whom God has joined together no one separate, you may kiss. You use that love as a guide to build your own stories as you go forward experiencing more of the adventures that you shared with us today because I'm sure that there's many adventures in your future. <laughs>